Hello, you guys. Welcome to YouTube Land. How you guys doing this evening? I'm coming to you right quick with uh the last finale for Candy Ski Trip. And uh, we're going to jump right into it. Nothing really interesting. It was <laughs> a little three-episode uh, season. And uh, basically, it started with uh, Carmen and Mama Joyce. They... um. It started off with from the last episode with them having a meeting. Candy set them up so they could talk. And uh Candy walked out the room and um it didn't it didn't end up ending too well. It ended up being a hollering session in there. And uh they basically both they basically both said at the end, let's do a um a lie detector test, you know, that um Carmen wasn't lying about sleeping with Todd and Mama Joyce not lying about where she heard it from. So they shook on it. And uh, Candy ran in the room to intercede because they was they was getting booked. They was getting booked, book, 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 book. Gotta hurry up because married to medicine on. Even though I DVR, I still gotta watch it. That's that's my shit. That's my shit. So we're gonna move right along. And uh, I seen Todd, he was having a little meeting with his uncle. No, the brother. The brother was saying that he had to leave. And they was kind of summing the trip up, basically, you know, what had went on. I'm not going to draw this out, nothing long. Um, Todd took the old lady gang, Aunt Bertha, Aunt Nora, on a little field trip to the weed house. And uh, Aunt Bertha was like, you can go up in there and buy weed like you buy chicken. And they ran out, and she's like, I might get a contact for being up in there. And they was just outdone the tie that took them there. Um, I think Matthew and um, I'm kind of rushing through this. Matthew basically tried to make a truce with Karma and uh, Don Juan. I see Don Juan just does not care for Todd. I was watching at the end when they were... Um, mending and blending and they wanted to see Todd's feet because Candy said when she first got with him, his his feet was terrible looking and she took him to a a, a dermatologist a shit should have been a podiatrist to check on his goddamn feet but I guess she, he helped him out so uh, basically um uh let me see where we gonna go with this and why the old lady gang was um Meeting with Aunt Bertha, Aunt Nora, met with Carmen, and they were uh, telling Car Karma, Karma, ever since Mama Joyce had that little procedure to stop her from having a stroke, she's been acting different. So maybe in her little mind, maybe she do see things. Hell, maybe she do think Todd and the girl fucking. Oh, let me get back to the argument. When Mama Joyce and Carmen was having an argument, Mama Joyce was basically saying that Carmen was trying to get Candy's old hair. And if it wasn't for Carmen working for Candy, she wouldn't be driving that nice car. She'd be in that old car instead of that BMW. But I just couldn't get ready when they was arguing about who wanted Candy's old hair. I'm like, are you serious? Are you fucking serious, Mama Joyce? You really on Nationwide TV putting this girl down? Talking about she wanted Candy's old hair? Come on now, Mama Joyce. Are you fucking kidding me? Are you fucking serious, man? So basically, Carmen, Carmen and Don Juan kind of made a truce with Matthew to quit being so mean. But Matthew basically said in his uh, confessionals that uh, when he moved to Atlanta from L.A., he going to have both of y'all motherfucking jobs. And uh, while they was having their little meeting, Don Juan was letting Matthew know, motherfucker, I ain't just her assistant. I am the GM. I'm the one who makes shit happen while you over there running Todd's mom and pop's business. I am the general manager. I said, whoo, whoop, there it is. Whoop, there it is. I guess he let us know. Shaka laka, shaka laka, shaka laka. Whoop, there it is. But uh, basically at the end, um, 
they all sit around and do a, a let it burn session and everybody talk about what they're gonna do to let it burn that was going on and the best part of that was mama joyce and candy i mean mama joyce and uh karma saying that they're gonna let it burn they're not gonna be um at each other's throats again and they're gonna let it go because basically i think mama joyce kind of believed todd when he said you know on his mama dead grave he has not slept with that girl so i think that's what kind of made mama joyce kind of relax but i think mama joyce is just sad and uh, when her candy and the girls did a little me time and they had the snowshoes on and they were just walking around laughing and playing and bonding together, Mama Joyce said, this is the first time I've been with candy ever since, you know, her and Todd got married. So, you know, bottom line, candy has been, it has been just candy and Mama Joyce. And I think when uh, Mama Joyce lost her son, she kind of just kind of just wanted her and candy to just be together but mama just candy got a life now she's a married now so candy ski trip on a scale from zero to ten i give it a seven and um i enjoyed it you know it is what it is i enjoy candy's little ski trip but now i gotta get to uh marriage medicine i'm dbr peace and um it ain't a, a great review. It wasn't really much to review. It is what it is, guys. Like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on Twitter, Tiki underscore 44. I have a Facebook, Tiki Hickman. Bye, guys. Good night.